a community united. The 818 really bleeds together. We fight together. We're a small knit community. But what we do do together is that we organize. So with Habitat Humanity extending their reach here to the San Fernando Valley, the East San Fernando Valley in particular, where it's word of mouth that is gonna bring people out here. The señoras, the trusted mujeres on the corners that are the ones that are really the information vessels of the San Fernando Valley are gonna come and get this information here. Promotoras, community health workers are gonna get information at this event and they're gonna spread their tentacles across the San Fernando Valley and share this much needed resources for our area. You're going to hear directly from Habitat LA staff who are experts in the field of affordable housing and homeownership and real estate. And lastly, you will have an opportunity to ask questions, very important questions in a group setting, but also one-on-one -on -one with our staff. We all know that we live in one of the most expensive housing markets in the country, and we understand the affordability crisis all too well. Today, over 300 people registered for this event, which means there's an overwhelming desire for people to have a pathway to home ownership. And this afternoon wouldn't be possible without the support of the City of San Fernando and your local members of the state legislature. I think it's important to have a partnership with Habitat, I think, because one, you guys provide so many resources to the community. Um, and it's not only, I think, saying, you know, the end goal is I want to have a house, right? But it's the everything, the work that it takes in between um, that you are there from every step of the way. That I know that like Habitat for Humanity has been knocking on some doors. And I think that like meeting uh, our residents where they're at is so important because a lot of the time I think um, our community might need help and they don't know who to ask for and they don't know where to go and maybe um, I think even myself sometimes I'm too prideful to ask for help right and so having someone come to my door and say hey we're here how can we help you um, is very helpful. I really, really didn't know what it was and it seems like they try to help people just buy their first home. There was this uh, like down payment assistance. It's like with Cal Home and there was this thing called Wish. It's like, so I learned that there's different resources, you know, there really is like funds out there to help that I didn't really know about before today. I actually live at home. So I actually live with my parents. And it's because of the uh, high cost of living. So I'm also a cancer patient. So that also takes a toll not only on you physically, but financially, emotionally. But, you know, filling, filling out that application is definitely giving me more desire to keep going. So I'm excited about that. Home is where love resides, memories are created, friends belong, and laughter never ends. These beautiful doors are opening new beginnings for your families. Home is where your story begins. Thank you, everyone. It can be overwhelming, I think it is overwhelming, the forms you have to go through, the qualifications, but Habitat is actually a um, nonprofit. It's here only to serve. So they're not gonna make money off of you. They're not gonna make, um, like money off a mortgage or commission. They're just giving you the information and helping you get ready. I'm a single mom, was a single mom for many, many years. And I had to work. I asked him, I said, uh, okay, do they have programs for seniors? You know, well, what if you're a single senior and living by yourself, can you still join the program? Would I be qualified for the program? He said, yes. It will be a fulfillment. Well, I'm still living and still able to say I have a home and perhaps pass it on to my son. He could do whatever he wants to with it, but it will be a personal fulfillment for me.